What's up guys, Ken Halloween 31 here. This is actually my first video I have made in a little while. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I really don't have much plans for videos. Um, I just kind of like doing my own thing. If people like it, people like it. Um, that's pretty much what I did with my old channel. But, um, yeah. I would like to announce that I rehauled and remastered quote-unquote, um, my two Halloween Kills masks. One of them was a standard edition, which I got, um, I actually pre-ordered from Trick or Treat Studios, and the other one I got from Spirit Halloween. Um, one of them I made into, um, just how the, how the movie went, there was no blood on it except for the shotgun wound and everything. The other one I bloodied it up. I did this about two months ago. And I got it to the way I like it, and it's like, hmm, I probably can do a lot better on this. So, I scrapped my old paint job, and I tried some different. And it looks a hell of a lot better. So, yeah, let's, let's see what I got. Um, the first mask I'm going to show y'all is my non-bloody edition, quote-unquote. Um, I just put the finishing touch on it today, um, which was just the blood, but here it is. This is, this is it. This took me about two months, maybe, just trying to get everything ready and everything. And if you notice, there is a gloss on the burn side. Kind of figured out a way how to do a gloss. Really cool. I really like it. The camera's not really showing up all the detail and everything, but if you go on my Instagram, you can see this in better pictures, better lighting, and everything. So, make sure to follow me on Instagram, 10 Halloween 31 But yeah, that is the first piece. I really don't have a good place to put him. But uh, just set them right there. Don't fall. There you go. Next one, I do not have a star from head for, but I did make a stain a long time ago, so I just put them on that. Um, this one, I need a plastic dip a little bit more. That's why I'm not going to wear any of them. But this is the bloody edition. I'm going to put my hand up underneath them. And yeah. This is the bloody edition. I think he came out amazing. You see a little more of the that detail. This one's actually a lot brighter than the other one for some odd reason. But I love the way this one came out. But yeah. Both of these rehauls were done by me. Each one of them probably took if I really worked on them I could probably do it in like three days. But yeah. Pretty cool looking mask, if I say so myself. So by the time this video will go up, I will put up some high res pics on my Instagram, 10 Halloween 31, quote unquote. But yeah, I hope y'all liked the video. Um, this probably won't be going up until like February 16th. Um, the reason why not tomorrow is because, well, that's just another story. Um, but yeah, I hope y'all liked the video, and make sure to hit the like and subscribe button because that helps out this channel a ton, and yeah, thank y'all for being here. Peace.